Hi, Tracy from Townsell Social Media Marketing here. This video is about the Facebook Business Manager. Now I signed up for it about a month ago and started moving all my pages that I admin and all my um, ad accounts that I admin over to the Business Manager. But I found that um, now I can't log in or share content to my my main page my my business page and apparently what happens is when you set up your business manager you assign a primary business page or Facebook page to your business uh, manager account and you can't sign in as that page in the old way you have to sign in continuously in the business manager so um, I did some research and spoke spoke to some people and I've worked out how to do it and and the best way to fix it is to actually assign a different business page as the primary page on your business manager now let me show you what I mean so this is the business manager and this is my primary page this is the one that I can't share to from my normal login so if I wanted to share this post and I'm signed in as me personally well you'll also note that you can't sign in as the page anymore because it's gone from from the list um, but if you you're in your own news feed and you find a post that you want to share on on a page if you click share you can share it as a page that you manage and you can select any page you like but you can never post as that page as the primary page so if I can I can post to my primary page but I can't post as my primary page it's not there which is very annoying so what we need to do is create a new page that will then become the primary page which will release my business page from being stuck in this um, business manager now I want to keep the business manager open because I'm sure that Facebook is going to sort things out and I don't want to go um, deleting the whole business manager the only problem that I have with it is that I can't share content from my personal newsfeed as my primary page so what you need to do is then log into your business manager click on the cog up the top and go into business manager settings and then down the bottom where it says info click on that you've got this this section up here and this is the information about your primary page so you can see their primary page is that so if we want to edit that we can just click on it and search on a page so I've created one called social social media tips and tricks so you, you have to create the, the new page first and then you can assign it here so what I'm going to do is now I've, I've created the page and I've assigned it here and I'm going to go save so fingers crossed so this is now the primary page social media tips and tricks that is now the primary page so the next step we need to do is remove the page from the business manager so uh, you can see actually if you click home you'll see that now we've got the new social media tips and tricks page which is owned by Townsville Social Media Marketing. That Townsville Social Media Marketing is the um, is the business manager. And that's the name of the whole account. So you'll notice um, I've still got uh, my main page, my primary page is still owned by Townsville Social Media Marketing which should actually be owned by me so that I can log in and use it in my up uh, my personal Facebook profile so we're gonna have to remove it um, and to do that uh, we need to go into settings and page
pages and then click on the page that we want to remove and so we're going to remove the page yep. so now this one is the primary page and uh, all the rest are just standalone pages which I want to I want to now bring in um, Towns of Social Media as a standalone page so I can still use it in the old old system as well. So we want to go and add a new page. So the option we want to put, um, click on is request access to the page. Go next, type in the uh, URL. That's it there. So we want page admin and we're going to request access. Okay, so now see how it says standalone page, standalone page, primary page. So this, this is a, now the primary page and Townsville Social Media Marketing is now the standalone page. Theoretically, when we go into our to my personal profile, and say so I want to share something Let's, uh, so I want to share something on my page we should now be able to do it as my page yay brilliant um, that's great that's that's going to be a huge help now so that's how you do it. So you've still got the business manager set up, but it's not tying up your business Facebook page. I've just I'm just using this um, blank new page to hold the place of the um, primary page. Well, good luck with that, um, and hopefully Facebook will get uh, business manager working more effectively.